10. Today is Friday, April 14th. I'm Lynn Maxwell and here's your school news. Hey junior class, if you haven't gotten your prom tickets by now, this is your last chance. Prom tickets will be on sale until today on the Arlington High School webpage under Arlington Web Store and the junior class link. Students must have a credit card in order to pay and must also print out a copy of their receipt. This receipt, along with the registration form and early release form, must be brought to seat signups after school on Thursday, April 20th. Can you sing, dance, act, play an instrument, do magic, stand up comedy, or have some other awesome talent? Then student government wants you to participate in their student talent show on Friday, June 2nd. You must sign up by Friday, April 28th to be a part of the show. Please see Miss Heaney in the library or Mr. Remet in room 2510 to sign up. And now, in the club scene, basketball intramurals will start on Tuesday, April 18th in gyms 5 and 6. Anyone interested in playing basketball after school needs to come to this meeting. They will attempt to make teams and play some ball. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Fight in room 1439. And now, I'm going to toss it over to Owen Stange, who has your weekly sports update. Oh, hey, Arlington. I'm Owen Stange, and this is your sports update. Let's cut to the chase, Arlington. The varsity golf team had three close matches back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back this week. They went 2-1, and one, beating Beeking and Pauling, but losing to Cornwall. Derek Gentile and Austin Kenyon were major contributors in the matches. The boys' varsity tennis team trounced Mayapak in their first match of the year, winning all seven matches. Stellar performances from Sebastian De Leon, Ryan Sticker, and Nick the Machini Regini. The varsity boys' lacrosse team won this week 14-7 over Lords. Luke Macon had five goals and an assist, and Brian Stensrud had three goals and seven assists. Spencer Hogeboom also scored twice. Last weekend, the spring track team participated in the Nyack Red and Black Invitational. Riley Pettigrew got great times and won both the girls 100 and 200. Other Arlington athletes winning their events were James Van Dagenen and Jake Vandermark, among others. Jess Owens, Aaron Lemieux, Talia Barardo, and Aileen Kevins each scored twice to lead the Arlington girls lacrosse team in an 11-6 win over New Rochelle on Wednesday. Simone Gillette made 18 saves in the win. Also on Wednesday, Jason Jackson and Joe Rupert each drove in two runs to lead the Arlington baseball team in a 6-1 win over Fox Lane. Jake Manko also went 2-4 for four with an RBI, and Eric Servione allowed one earned run in six innings. That's enough sports for today, Arlington. Have a great day. Was that good? No, that was was it? Let's go! Really Dude, I killed that. I killed that. Thanks, man. I'm done. That's your news for today, Arlington. It's an A-Day. Did you know, in the early 1940s, a torsion spring fell off marine engineer Richard James' desk and tumbled end over end across the floor. He took it home to his wife, Betty, who gave it to the cute name since then. More than a quarter billion slinkies have been sold worldwide. 